Although fleas and ticks are a threat to pets year-round, as we approach spring, they become more common, which can have a big effect on their health. So for fleas, if they get like a flea infestment, it can cause an infection, and then, you know, with an infection, their health can deteriorate. Um, but also, fleas are just bad in general because, again, they can carry diseases, and if it's not treated in a certain amount of time, then the pet, it can be fatal to their health, obviously. So Many treatments can help protect and prevent your pets from fleas. So there's um, a topical treatment and a oral treatment. So for smaller dogs, we usually do like uh, the topical ones where you can put on their skin. And then the oral ones are kind of like once a month, and then they're usually on it all year round. Treatments can be picked up from the store like here at Petco. But like Thrive Vet Care, many hospitals offer their care to treat your pets. Um, so if the dog or cat has fleas, we usually do like a flea bath first, and then we start, we start them on a preventative, which is like the oral or the um, topical medication that I was talking about. So we usually do the treatment here, and then we give them like the actual medication after. Fleas are attracted from other pets or the outside environment. Being aware of your pet and being consistent with treatment can be a big help. Um, I think the best thing is to start them on a preventative, which is the one that I was talking about before, the oral or the topical treatment. I think it's good to start that and then make sure you're consistently giving it to them according to the instructions. So like if it's once a month, make sure you're giving, you're giving it to them like on the same day of every month. Um, but other than that, just make sure that you are like looking in your like furniture and stuff like that. Because even if we're not going out as much, it can still come into the house with them. For Canyons News, I'm Melissa Lomelli.